All right, guys, times are tough, but we put together five reasons to be cheerful. In at number five, we're the envy of the world. Maybe not in a footballing sense, but in a commercial arm sense. Now, this is a model that clubs like Barcelona and Real Madrid have tried to reproduce. They're jealous of it. We've got tyre sponsors. We've got commercial airline sponsors. We've got tomato juice sponsors. We've probably got an official condom. We are raking in the money from across the globe. We've got a great reputation. And you know who that's keeping happy? The Glazers. And number four, while we're talking about money, we have got a phenomenal war chest. We've got bags of money. We're going to be buying world-class players in the summer. They're all going to be coming. They might all be playing in the number 10 position and out of position, but we're going to get them. In at number three, the future's bright, the future's red. We have got some sensational young players. Some of them already in our starting lineups. You've got Welbeck, you've got De Gea, you've got Clever... You've got Evans, you've got Smalling, you've got Jones, you've got Raphael. We've got people like Lingard and Paul who have been excelling on loan. We've got Zaha who's finally getting a game. And who's that that we've got? More than anyone, we've got bloody Yannese! In at number two, we've still got some world-class players. We've got De Gea, Rooney just signed a new contract. We've still got RVP. And you know what? If some of the players aren't world-class, they're bloody nice. They've got world-class manners. In today's football, all players are horrible. Not our players. We've got Welbeck. You take him home to meet your parents. Ashley Young, he's off trying to cure incurable diseases all the time. Hernandez. You're telling me Hernandez isn't nice? What about little Kagawa? Little cute Kagawa, never complaining. We've got some nice players. Just remember that. In at number one, everything's going to be okay. We're going to recover. We're in the perfect position. No one's got the fans that we've got. No one's got the stadium that we've got. The worldwide appeal that we've got. The history that we've got. No one's got the financial clout that we're going to have in the summer. They don't have David Moyes' transfer bunker with people on iPads swiping stuff and doing shit that we don't understand. We've still got world-class players to attract people to us. We've still got bloody Ferguson. We've got Woodward. Would you trust Woodward? I would. Would. So we've got him. We've still got David Gill. We've got the Glazers. They're going to do something. We are not going to be in this position for long. Everything's going to be okay. So there you go. That's our top five reasons to be cheerful. Turn your frowns upside down and, and well, and smile as well. Leave your comments below. Let us know what you think. But most importantly, subscribe.